all right guys welcome back to the channel it's been a while the winter time it's slow for us but today yesterday we had a big storm come through uh our town and uh knocked over several several trees on this street so uh we piling it up here by the edge of the road and uh the grapple truck is gonna come by and pick this up just shortly then we gotta go do another job and uh do a tree that's on the house so that's what i got and uh it's gonna be a busy day back at the job on this one it's about one o'clock in the afternoon and we're finished taking all this getting all this up he got this all in one load so uh we get this little pile right here dress up up this a little bit i have to come back grind the stump and this job will be done and you wonder why i do this like during the storms it's so much quicker so I didn't have time to run my trucks. We was busy taking this uh, this other tree off of his house. So, uh, so that's what we got. What we're doing today. We still gotta finish doing it, messing with it. Uh, I'll probably work Sunday, and uh, that's it. Yeah, knock this out, make this look a little bit different. The only thing they'll have left is mulch off of this. As the second project of today. This whole neighborhood has storm damage. They, was, they got a guy across the street with a crane doing a uh, cedar tree off the house. And now we're doing this tree on the back of the house. Uh, this fell. Carlos is blowing the leaves to make sure we ain't, you know, gonna fall off of it. I'll take you around to the, to the I got to watch out. Uh, he's blowing it all over. This tree fell down. We got to get rid of it. Here's the one where it's up on the house. Yeah, it's caused a good bit of damage. If I knew that uh, the crane can get in here, I'd use the crane. But I don't think he can get all the way through the, these trees and swing it around. It's in a very, very bad position. So we're going to cut it, throw it off to the uh, to the front of the house on the limb, and then tie the log off to this tree right here and uh cut it back so you know as long as it'll hold just for a minute or two we can cut these limbs and gotta be careful we got the glass but we'll do what we can all right guys it's at the end of the day and the tree is on the ground carlos we tied the rope to this tree right here ran the ran it down to this tree ran it out to the front of the house where my truck's parked to get it off of this this uh this house right here so uh, it's been an ordeal couldn't get a crane in here at all it's busy as i'll get out today can't get a crane i called one there was a guy across the street with a crane and uh you know he said he he didn't have time so but i put the truck i did a redirect right here and put the truck tied to, and that's how we did it we put a rope right here and that tree swung away from the house and laid down so that, that's the best we could do in this situation and uh yeah it didn't it didn't do they was afraid it's gonna break the window was afraid it's gonna you know hit the, the side of the house all this that but it turned out real well. 
and the sun's going down and it's fixed to get cold and we're going we're fixing to load up and go to the house come back tomorrow we'll cut this up and uh, pile it by the road and let the grapple truck guy come and get it and uh, move on to another one he's here we're fixing to load this up and uh, this job is done we got it off the house and uh, he's gonna finish loading this up real quick won't take but a few minutes and we'll, uh, we're done for the day Danny's not feeling good so he's throwing up when we got we come back from lunch so and the storm's coming we got snow coming this way so that's going to shut us down for three or four days and uh that's it hey guys if you like the video hit the like button and the subscribe and i'll uh see you on the next one